Hey guys, and welcome back to Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to take the perfect photo of your Pokemon for your trainer icon, because I see a lot of people are still struggling because the Pokemon won't stand still. It's like, you know, it's it's moving around too much. Now I figured out some way to kind of make it so that you can get a nice photo for at least all different Pokemon. Unfortunately, you are still limited by the Pokemon has to be a certain distance away from you, but let me just get into it and show you. So in order to change your trainer icon, you're gonna be pressing the minus button, you're gonna be pressing the X button down into profile. And then from here, you're gonna hit plus and you're gonna to go to trainer icon and you're going to be taking a new photo. Now, if you look at my top left photo, you can see I have a really nice photo of Iron Valiant, almost like whole torso plus head. Like that is a brilliant photo. You're probably asking, how did I get that? Because normally it's insane. And this is not in the wild either. So essentially what you should know is that when you throw a Pokemon with the ZR key, right? The, the right trigger, you'll see that the, the Pokemon uh, Iron Valiant is facing me right now. But if I turn around and I go over here and I throw it, you'll see, it will still be facing that same direction. Every time you throw a Pokemon out, they'll always be facing the same direction. So what you wanna do is like, if you were here, you're like, oh, well, I'm gonna get a terrible shot. It's gonna be the back of the head, right? Now, I don't want that. So I'm gonna be in, I'm gonna put myself in a position where Iron Valiance is gonna be there in front of me. You're gonna press the minus key. You're gonna press X. You're gonna go down to profile. Now you have to do this fast enough because after a short time, the Pokemon goes to sleep. Go down to trainer icon and then take a new photo. And then, yeah, see, I was a bit too slow over there and it already started running around. Once it gets into this point, it's like, it's, it's impossible. Like, how's anybody supposed to get a photo like this? So if I go ahead and I do that quickly again, I'm gonna go like this, minus X, down to profile. We're gonna hit the plus button. We're gonna go to trainer icon, take a new photo, and you'll see, bam, we have the perfect lineup already. I can't tell if I like this one. I think I like this one more. There we go. That is our new profile picture of Iron Valiant in the desert. I kind of like the backdrop of the of the sand. It kind of highlights the, the Pokemon a lot more. So essentially what you need to do is stand very still. You check where your Pokemon's facing. You don't move at all. Because the moment you move, as you can see, just one step forward, the Pokemon moves too. And then it goes into a mobile mode, right? So you need to so you need to stand dead still, press ZR once find the perfect angle and go like, okay, cool. No, that's that's too much this way. I wanna stand here and I want you to be like this, facing a little bit more to me, but a little bit to the side so you get like a nice angle. And then you take the shot like that, obviously by opening up your training icon, taking the photo as quickly as possible before it starts moving. And that is all you need to know, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching.